guys, what's going on? It's Fire Renick here. We're back here in episode 2 in Farming Simulator 2019. Or Farming Simulator 19, whatever you guys like. So we're up here at the shop right now. Um, on our map, I got the hood hided in this video. Let me know what you guys prefer better. Like the like how I'm doing right now, it looks more realistic. Let me know. That's what I'd say. But we're going to hop in the 6145M here. And we got the nice fertilizer spreader on the back. And we're going to go spread some lime. First time ever trying to spread lime, so we're gonna head up to the fields right now and let's go see what we can do. We got for coming for cars. Cars are always a pain in the rear end. So, um, yeah, I'm recording videos back to back here, so I could not tell you what's going on for the dog name or any of that stuff if you guys, if we even got that figured out. Um, I'm recording back to back, so it's gonna be about a week. I'm gonna have enough videos recorded on Saturday here for about a week, so. That way, because I'm going to probably be busy next week with a lot of other stuff going on. And if it dries up enough or the snow thaws, melts, I mean, um, we got to be out in the field. So that way you guys would have something to look forward to if Tirebug and, Tire and I can both post. So daily for you guys, 19 for you guys, because I'm pretty sure you guys want to see 19. I think there's like three days or something before you guys can get it. And yeah. So we're going to have lots of videos of it. Roll it up here. Let's see the, how this lime works. Yeah, I don't even say it's too much of a different color. I've never spread lime at all. All of I've really spread it, I've spread a bit of potash and I can't remember what else was mixed in it. But I spread a little bit. So this will be the first time ever spreading stuff in Farming Simulator 17 here. Not 17, 19. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Yeah, you guys are going to catch me a lot saying 17. It's going to be hard because I'm so used to saying 17 all the time. But now i got to get used to saying 19. So roast me guys in the comments section if I say 17. I'll give you permission. So we got the bales all picked up and we got the 6230, I think that is, if I can remember correctly. Um, we got it up over there. We own field 19 maybe. Yeah, we don't feel 19. There we go. Alright, let's turn our flashers off. Or four ways. So we're going to be planting, spreading lime, you name her. Let's see how this works. Ready? Go. There we go. I don't think it's spreading. Uh oh, they not take lime? Mm. Does anybody know? Why they don't want lime? I'll see if a hard worker would do anything. Did I fill this lime up for nothing? I don't think it's counting. Let's go here. Um, soil. There nothing there. There isn't no fertilizer. Yeah, there's fertilizer. Weeding. Fertilizer needs plowing, needs lime. So none of our fields need lime, honestly. But those fields all need lime. Oh, so you have to watch and see if they actually need lime. My bad. Alrighty. How much? Good thing I only bought two totes of this stuff. Let's do a little cheating here. Let's reset this back to the shop. And let's find our spreader. Reset it. And let's see if it's like 17 when you reset stuff. It automatically goes empty. I'm hoping it does. Yeah, good. So when you reset stuff, it disappears in it. So that's perfect for us. Especially on this occasion here. Alright, let's buy some pallets here in the shop up here. So you'd have your brands. And then you'd have all your tractors and vehicles, stuff you can kind of drive. Then you'd have all your implements in here. That's kind of nice. And then you'd have your pallets 
and then your bags, pallets, and bales. Yes, there's buy bales in here. Then you have all your animal placeables, and then you have some of these sheds, wood chipper, pressure washer workshop, and water station. And you'd have your silos, pits, and everything in here. Decorations, lots of different barns and sandcastle, and three different sheds, and your farmhouse. So there you go. Let's buy some pallets. Make sure you get the right one. So there's pig food, there's horse food, and there's chicken. Let's buy some fertilizer. Let's buy probably somewhere around three to four. Oh. We'll see what that looks like. That's kind of cool how it, when you're uh, filling it up, it revs up. What's my steering at? 80? We'll turn it up to 90. It's better for us. But you have to have it like 80 something for the skid steers. Like, you guys would have to mess with it and see what you're more comfortable with and what you guys like the best, or the most, I should say. Get her over here. Put this bad boy in here. Oop, hit the bag a little. That's okay. Hope you guys can hear me well. I think the first video was kind of a little bit quiet. Let's buy, what, three more? I just don't want to buy too many. That way I have some sitting here like I have a liquider. A liquid one sitting here. Sorry. Alright. I can get it from here. Good. See, there it revs up when it's filling. Good, I can just sit here. I can't sit there for that one. Should have brought the loader up. But I think there's a way that you can put the loader on. Uh, I think James found that earlier, so we'll have to see. But yeah, we'll do a stream with James and stuff. Probably in a week, but I probably this Friday or night or Saturday coming up. Um, we'll do something like that. And we'll go from there. Um, Alright, let's head down to the fields. Let's pull some fertilizer on them. Show the four ways on, flashers. Nobody's coming. Let's go. He didn't even stop. Hey, I stopped. If you guys are hearing that little beeping, that's your flashers. But usually it's not beeping. Usually it beeps when you turn left or right near uh, 6430. It does that, but usually in real life it just kind of, it's quiet when you're going down the road. It, or it kind of ticks usually, but that's about it. So. Alright. Got my nice, ooh. I got my nice sunglasses on. My uh, John Deere hat, because I love John Deere, you know. But I'd probably wear, I don't know what other hats are, I have to mess around with all this stuff. But you guys would, you guys will have to wait and see. It's all a surprise for you guys. Nice interior here. No radio. What? What's up with that? Okay, that orange foot pedal down there, that's what you call the foot throttle. And then there's your two brakes and your clutch. And then there's your shifter up there where you go forward, reverse, or neutral. And there's your gears. It's not the accelerator squad if you're seeing this. Just saying. It's not the accelerator people. So. Yeah. Sunroof in here. I think there needs to be some more John Deere in this game. But hey, it's a start. They got a few in here, so we can't I can't complain really. What did I tell you guys? I think I might have told you this, that the games are slowly going to be more realistic. But yeah, they are. They're starting to come more realistic. And I'm I'm going to try and probably like a realistic farm series, kind of like what we got sort of in there. Some sort of something like that. Alright, this time it should work. But it ain't showing up white. I don't know. I thought it always showed up white. I wonder if there's a way you can fix that. Mm, auto? No. Uh, 
plowing with crop, lime on, weeds on, plant withering crop damage. I don't know what that one is. That one didn't make a difference. I guess we'll just spread it, but I was kind of hoping to work in the fertilizer. Shock, strong button. I'll have to look into it and see what I can find for next time, unfortunately, I guess. Because I really wanted it to show all white. That ground covered in white so you guys could see the fertilizer. That would be nice and then work it in. We don't need to get that corner. Well, we did anyways. Yeah, we pretty much got it all here anyways. Be a bit back there we didn't get. But that would be our little, uh, see if it, how good it yields. Pretty much getting it all. Let's do a little swinging around here. Whoop. There we go. Back it up. Let's go out our, go out our gateway I'm making here. That's on. I like this feature in here because you guys can see you're packing out a gateway. So if you want to make a gateway into the in and out of the field, you can by just driving in the same spot. All right, let's cross the road over here. Bowl some fertilizer on this field and some more back there. Mostly just probably going to get to spreading the fertilizer today. That's okay. Let's do these two fields this way because they're so short. I don't know. Do you guys want me to work those two together? If not, let me let me know if you guys want those two plowed together or leave them as they are. Let me know. If you guys enjoy FS19, smash that like button. Make sure you're subscribed and turn on post notifications. Get a little closer so you guys can hear it more. So there's another feature right there. If you zoom out, you can hardly hear them. But you zoom into them, you can hear them. So, yeah, let's keep her going. I'll keep spreading this fertilizer up and down as we're going. Whoops. Turn the radio on accident. Don't want that one. Don't push that button. That don't button. Don't. That's no bueno. So, we're just put down this field. And then we will uh, blow some. Actually, we'll do that field later. Maybe we won't blow three stages of fertilizer on it. But I feel like it's showing up on the grass. Hear the flag moving. Okay, let's park this tractor down here in the shade. We'll let it cool off. We'll get it here later. It's kind of in the shade, you know. Let's back it up our little trail. Or just go back into the tree. That works too. That works too. But one thing, there's no 19 or there's no GPS in here yet. I'm so used to GPS and it. I'm just, I just can't wait till the GPS mod comes out. <laughs> or maybe I have to get used to not using it for a while. Is that a thing we need to do? Probably. Let's drop this bad boy in and let's get her going. How fast are we plowing here? 10 mile an hour? We don't want 10. We'll do five. Set our crew stroll for five, and let's do five. More realistic. Because real life, I was ripping between six to five and a half. Most of the time there. Let's pull a little bit of this grass back, or cultivated or whatever. 
Let's plow most of it back. That way it's plowed back a little bit. Ooh. I think this this harrow likes to wander around a little bit because it's driven by the not the um yeah driven by the three point it's hooked on the three point not like a drawbar plus all the wheels in the back is it's that rolling arrows on the back i think that might be all it's holding oh no when you lift it up i guess the wheels do come but it's not i i prefer a pull type like this see there it kind of slided on us yeah, I'd prefer probably a pull type. Like drawbar. The cook's on the back of the drawbar. We're gonna get that a little bit. Uh, I don't know. Alright. Let's just take our time. Do a good job. Be all good. I don't think we could crank. Let's see how good if we can make a straight line in the middle here. Kind of do it in lands like all of here in real life there. Let's see how good we can do it. I don't think it's going to be too straight. <laughs> but it'll be okay. As long as it's straight enough. Or that way we can... As long as it's not like left or right. And like someone was drunk. I'll put it that way. It looks pretty decent, I could say, or I would say, my bad. Let's see if we can get rid of some of these bushes. I hate these bushes. Get rid of them. But you know what would be cool is you could cut them off with a chainsaw and get rid of them. That'd be cool. So sh let me guys, let me know what you guys want to see in FS19, and I'll do it. You guys like want a shop tour and all that kind of stuff? Do you guys want like a shop tour and all that kind of stuff? Let me know. I can see what I can do. But here's a nice feature right here. Dynamic hoses. They all plug in. At least the hydraulics plug in where they're supposed to. And the other ones, they're they're not quite there, but they're getting there. They're pretty darn close, so I can't complain. You guys are probably saying, "Why don't you use that MX over there?" Well, we'll use it one of the, we'll use it for planting. How's that sound? I think we'll use the MX for planting. We'll have to buy a corn planter, so we'll have to buy one of them, and we'll probably end up putting it on that. We're gonna plant some corn, some soybeans, possibly field wheat and some oats. Let me know if you want me to pick up a couple more acres. Like I was thinking about buying either field 23, it's just down the road, so we could buy 23, 22, those two. We could buy those two for now. But see, they need lime. That's the thing, right? I don't know. Then we have to buy a lime spreader again. We'll see. We might not give them lime, honestly, because then I'd have to buy, like, a tow, and then I'd be either short some or not have enough. So I think we'll basically, if we do end up buying those fields, is what we'll do is we'll wait until all of our fields require lime, and then we'll just blow it on all of them and demo it, order a whole bunch, and that'll be it. All right, that field's done. 
carrying a gear. Let's drop her in. Oh, there we go. So we're plowing up the last hill we got. And we'll see what else we can do. Tractor's just kind of idling. Not making it work. That's what we want to see. Picked it up maybe a tad early. Drop her in. Make sure we're not missing any. Let's run some inside of the cab here. Yeah, I don't like that. We'll do this. There's a nice little... It's a nice spot right there. Ooh, got pick her up. See, this side has a shadow. We don't like that. I like the other side. Well, that's kind of neat. But the sky is really awesome. Like, the sky, it's really realistic. You guys will just have to wait and see. off the rock here. Hey, where are you going? Get her over there. There we go. You guys can see where the disc wanted to start sliding around on us. There we go. Sorry about that. Pushed the wrong button. fun washing job or we could just leave for the rain sounds like a better idea what do you guys think about that I wonder what happened if you never washed any of your equipment like in farm sim I know it, it It'll start staining your stuff in real life because it's real life, right? It's not got a game. But we'll just have to see. I think eventually the rain would wash it off. Pulling a little tough there. overlap here just a little bit that way can straighten us out over here you guys can see up here how it's not it's kind of like going over towards the right of us perfect got that cleaned up Drop her down, and away we go.
Up she comes, down around. Let's back her up. What was that? I thought I seen some picture or poster thing down there. But I think it's just like ah, I think it's just the ground. Kind of a glare on it. Sit on top of the pot, you guys can hear it. The disc turn and that's a nice feature I like. Robber in. Oh, there we go. Up she comes. There she's up. Let's get this little bit of corner piece over here. And let's go find a didn't want that one. I think we'll get a pressure washer. I don't know where to post it. <laughs> Not post it. Put it. My bad. Jesus. Creepers. Guys. Alright. Let's go into the barn. Uh, here. Where do we want our pressure washer? Up along the tree. But uh, no, I'd like to probably park stuff there. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Right by the shelf. Exactly where we want to put it. Run this guy over here. Perfect spot. Now, let's see if I remember how to use this thing. Yep. Pressure wash these wheels off. Let's clean it up. Clean the loader frame all up. Hopefully, I don't make you guys dizzy. We gotta have the John Deere nice and clean, you know. Oh, a little bit on the staff. Step, not staff. Gosh, my I'm mixing words up bad today. Tripping over words. Let's wash the old dis hair all up. Wash those blades up. Clean that tire out, make it shine. Let's open this thing up here. We'll pull it up here, we'll leave it sitting up here in front of the shop, and I'll put it in the shop here later tonight after it dries, or maybe we'll do that tomorrow, we'll see. We'll leave it sitting there, that way it's nice and dry, the bearings don't get water, and then you'll have to replace them all. That's the whole process that I want to do. So for now, I just stacked the, what do we got? Eight bales sitting here, I just stacked them up, and we are just kind of sitting up against the barn, so... We'll see if we want to use them, or we'll just might just leave them here. I'm not quite sure. Um, what else? Train, combine, truck. Let's get this fertilizer back in a shed for tonight, just in case the rain comes up and we don't want fertilizer in our uh, spreader here. That would not be good. Even if we just had a bit in it, that'd be all right. I just want to keep the spreader nice and dry. Or else it rains, fertilizer will get stuck to the inside, and then you'll have to get in and shovel it all out. That's not fun. There we go. There we go. She's all nice and cleaned up for tomorrow. Alrighty, guys, I think we'll uh, wrap her up here today. So if you guys enjoyed the video, smash that like button, subscribe. Turn on post notifications, and don't forget, I'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for watching, guys.